Hey guys, welcome back to Subnautica. Um, so I know there's a message. I don't think the Sunbeam will do it. Oh my goodness. Uh, I don't think the Sunbeam will do anything if we don't listen to those. I'm pretty sure that only starts if you start actually listening to them. Wow. What does it take for storage? Titanium. Perfect. Let's titanium. We'll throw all of our titanium in there because somehow, wow, I've got a whole ton. My goodness. All right. So, every part of me really wants to click on that, uh, click on that, but I know. I shan't not. Where's... There it is. Okay. So I want to make a thing that titanium ingot. We'll, f we'll start with that. Okay, titanium ingot. Not plasteel. Ten! Ah! Okay, we might not have much more anymore. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Wow, my goodness, that is that is a rocker. Okay. Well, we got that now. Now what else do we need to We need a lubricant. Lubricant is made from cluster seeds. I don't think I have any. No, I do not. Okay. What else do I need? I also need... Something. If I can remember where I'm going. Power cell. My goodness. Okay. Silicone rubber was pretty easy to make, I'm pretty sure. Okay. So <laughs> do what I want. And two. Okay, so we need two copper ore and four mushrooms. Right, okay. Vital signs stabilizing. Okay. Welcome aboard, Captain. Welcome aboard, Captain. Silicon rubber. I'm gonna make our titanium. Get clear out of inventory a little bit. And then. Power is set. Uh, Batteries to batteries. Power cell. Q. I will transfer all that stuff over. And then we shall make a mobile vehicle bay. So cool. It looks like a little drone thing right here. It's kind of kind of cool. All right, let's go set it up. Be cool. Let's clear out inventory a little bit. Let's make this water just cause just the fish itself don't do my, don't do me much good. All right. Really? Oh, okay. Thank you. I will. I will do that. Actually, I have to find it. That's kind of annoying. Let's kind of go down here. I want to see it just float up. Because why not? You know? Oh, hi there. Yeah, here's a good spot as any. Yes. It was, it was slightly less satisfying than I expected. But you know what? It's still cool. 
Can I get on it? No, it has to float first. Oh, this is no Jones. Hi, buddies. What? Climb. Oh, okay. No, I don't need to climb. Thank you. Hi. Okay. Sea mob. That's not that hard to make. Hold up. All we need is the copper and the lube, right? I'm trying to think. What does it take to make power cells? I don't remember. <laughs> anyway, I do know. It's got like three of those. And then we're just gonna go find some copper. Okay, two batteries. And then I have some silicone rubber in here. All right, is and I need one. I'm gonna need one of those for the the kind for the uh. See my off. Alright, let's go see what I'm missing. Oh, that's really floating in a spot there. Hi buddies. Okay. Titanium ingot and glass. Oh no. Oh no. That's something else I needed. I don't think I have what it takes to make glass. One, two, three, four, five, six, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I think it said two glass, right? So, quartz, yes, 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 quartz, quartz, quartz. I do. Ha. Heck yeah. Cool. I think that's everything, right? I think so. Heck yeah, we're gonna shim off. There we go. <laughs> Broke it. Whew. All right, let's do it. The sea moth is a fast, safe mode of transport, but remember that swimming is good for your glutes and endorphin levels. She me to leave me alone. Sea moth. Huh? Huh? Let me out. Let's go. So cool. Oh, that's so cool. It just looks so good. Oh, I love it. I love it. Calorie intake recommended. 75, 20, right? So I think I, yeah, okay. This nutrition. Blocks are fantastic. Okay. Welcome aboard, Captain. Oh. Oh, it's so cool. I love it. I'm pretty sure it does like a little beacon spot, right? Yeah. So before we go out, let's make a little beacon. Welcome aboard, Captain. So that I can know where to come back to. Oh, wow, well, that's actually a lot easier to make than I thought. Nice. Alright, 
Uh, it's pretty sure it's attached. Yeah. I was kind of hide it under here somewhere. Bash. There we go. I'll be able to find it now. Okay. Should we take Seamoth Exploring? I think that. I think so. <laughs> That's so funny. I forgot you can do that. Get used to the turning a little bit. All right, now we can go down deep. Ooh, it's so spooky down here. So this is where I was before. It's kind of exploring this a little bit. Warning: maximum depth reached. Hull oh. damage imminent. Are you serious? Passing 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Passing 200 meters. Okay, well, I saw you, Zimaz. I heard you. I didn't. I've. Oh! Oh, hi! Was that what that sound was earlier? Is it a little teleporty voice? I oh, sorry. I oh, sorry. sorry. I don't no, remember how to fix it. Oh my goodness. I'm sorry, Zimaz. I keep going below here. Okay, let's just go down and see how much, what, if we can find anything cool. Oh, it just keeps going down. I found a ruby. Nothing else too exciting. It's time to head back up, though, which is unfortunate. So I feel like even with the rebreather, we're not going to be able to get very far. I don't know. I didn't realize I still can't go deep. Rig me. Alright. We'll give it one last try. Let's see... We can get to anything cool. What the freak is that? I don't remember that fish. It won't work. Let's get down to the, the bottom down here. There's not really anything too crazy to explore. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm leaving. My bad. Well, that's, that's, that's about it. Oh no, are we gonna make it? Yeah, we'll make it. We're pretty close already. Swim to surface. No. I stood in my sea moth. Well, that's very pretty depressing, actually. That's as low as I can go. Let's go do splash. Whoosh. Oh yeah, it was cool. Wow, we went really must like we went pretty high. Seeing nothing but water is a little scary, so we're gonna go back over here where we can see the ground. Hmm. I don't know what to do now. I really thought once I found the sea moth, I could go lots deeper, but can't really go that much deeper. I mean, we can. We we did we did go a lot deeper, but like still, like not really at the same time, you know. I don't 
know what else to do. I don't know what... Oh, you know what? I do know what to do. We'll go do a beat that... We'll go listen to that intercom. Maybe there'll be something cool. If not, we may just call the episode. I really wonder if the light plays a big role on uh, how much power is used. Or any role, you know? I, I'm the kind of person that even if it makes a minor role, I'll still try and, try and save. Uh. Gotcha! <laughs> That's hilarious. Is that it right there? I don't know. Vital signs stabilizing. Okay. I'll come listen to your message. High priority automated message from Aurora Live Pod 13 coordinates attached. Live Pod is carrying high priority passenger. Yoki Kasa. I said Kasa. Why do I have to record this anyway? Send immediate burial detail. Oh. Signal location uploaded. To that's, that's so sad. Just, just said very detail. That's all you need. Okay. Well. I guess that's us. Ah, oh, this is so cute. Just have a little guy right in. I don't know if it really. I wonder what the speed difference is between this and the. whatever the little pulley thing is. Fetch. <laughs> um, you know? I feel like. I don't feel that much of a difference, but maybe. maybe it is, and I'm just. unappreciative. Where I went down before with the little snakes. Oh yeah, we still can't go very far. And those little serpent things scare the fetch out of me. I'll mentally prepare myself for next episode, but I'm not mentally prepared for this episode. I think next episode we'll try and build the scanner room and then we'll go we'll go explore that. Um oh, we we're getting a bit of both. I just about pressed E like hoping it would like help me turn. Oh. I knew this biome was a thing, but I didn't... I don't know. I just didn't know where it was. Or how to get to it, or how deep it was. So I didn't really worry about it. But this is cool. I'm glad we're here, because I know there's a, there's a unique ore here. And not gonna lie, I'm hoping a little bit in this area is dominated by plant life. Picking up faint or terror vehicle signatures. Passing yep. 100 meters. Huh. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Interesting. Oh, I want my knife, please. Where's my knife? Thank you. Hi, fishy. What you doing? Integrating new PDA data. So loud. Thank you. Is it all just story? 
I was really hoping it would give me some. Are you gonna hurt me? Doesn't look like it. Well, I'm just curious, like, I didn't think it attacked you, but I was curious if it shocked you if you touched it. Jelly Ray! Altera Signature. Welcome aboard, Captain. So, yeah, I know there's a unique ore here, but I don't know what it is. Or where to find it. I thought it was just like on the side of this giant tree here. I don't see anything for now. We'll go dive in a little bit through these tunnels. Oh. A pretty. What do I want me to scan these? Tree leech? Ooh. Oh. Interesting. Okay. Creature egg. Gold. No, I ha- You are currently inside a long calcified root system. Evidence suggests it was eaten away by other life forms over many centuries to form these natural caves. Yes! The materials you gather are the property of the all Terra Corporation. <laughs> you will be liable to reimburse the full market price. Your current bill stands at three million credits. Sweet beer. My goodness. I love how it's right as you find diamonds and it's like, oh, by the way, you you owe us for that. Or oh, that's that's ours. Oh, that's cute. I only found one though. I would like to find more. My goodness, those are. Hi. Yeah. Hi. My goodness, these tunnels are ridiculous. No more tunnels? Huh. Okay. Is there like the one tunnel? This was the one tunnel I went in, right? Yeah. I don't know where else. This space, like, does it go anywhere else? Oh, it really just keeps going up and up. This is a. Don't wait too long to get out of this one. Gold and diamond. Wow, this is a. This is a fancy tree. Okay. Come on, I just want to find one more diamond. Please. Please. I just want to spare, just in case. So I don't have to come back. Please. Fine. We'll start trying to figure out how to get out of here. 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Where in the world? There we go. Ugh, this place is a maze. I don't know. I imagine it looks even worse for you guys. Uh, <laughs> right, another fish. <laughs> okay. Well, I know there's a crash site around here somewhere. But I think... Oh, hi there. The best... Oh, what is that? a mystery okay tree mushroom but I think I would need the oh I saw we I saw you seem off do I have a repair tool on me no of course not. wait yeah I do okay good I'm sorry no that's not what I wanted to do there we go you feel better now I saw it. Let's take you home. So whatever crash site is in here, I'm sure the cutter would highly um whatever whatever the word I'm looking for is would help. Um
because I kind of do need that to get really anywhere. Ah! Oh my goodness, I don't know how to drive. Driving's a little hard. Oh. Did I explore this? Yes, 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 I did. I'm pretty sure I even... Yeah, yeah. This is what I explored last episode. I think I do need a cutter for that one, too. So let's just keep going back to base. And that'll help in future episodes with exploring. Hopefully we'll get some good stuff. Get a... Whatever it's called, the um, uh, charger for the big batteries. I can't remember what they're called. It's quite unfortunate for me. Oh. Hi. Another message. Wow. Well, we don't got time for that. Cool, though. I need two. <laughs> I'm gonna cry. <laughs> oh my break. Didn't really didn't realize I didn't know I needed two. That's kind of annoying actually. Well, no laser cutter. Instead, we are listen to the kind. Uh, data bank. Flora, we don't need to listen to all this stuff. I don't need to listen to that. These, these are what we want. as I give to those who seek pleasures from me. External temperature approaching critical levels. Show me the path in life, truth, and love, for mine is the power. I am the one, on and off and on again. Impact imminent. Life is a game which the universe plays with itself. I am done playing as this bundle of flesh. That is a real interesting prayer. My okay. How's his log? It's the day of the crash. I don't know what the heck is happening. I'm scared and I'm not going outside. There are shadows in the water under the hatch, but I can't tell if they're rocks or aliens. And there's weird looking caves nearby. The Aurora was carrying everything needed to build the phase gate. Mobile vehicle bays, bioreactors, propulsion cannons. It had a cinema. There, there was a zero-G gym. My cafe. I don't understand how we're here now. I don't know why no one's coming for me. Hmm. Ciao, buddy. I don't, I don't think you made it. The Gossy Crew Manifest. Margaret Maida. Did I read any of these? Pretty sure I read this one, because it's not new, yeah. Auxiliary Search and Rescue Mission. Margaret Maida. Position Freelance Security Personnel. Status, lost in space near planet 4546B. Age at time of disappearance, 42. Mercenary born on Mo the Mongolian states. Experienced in ship-to-ship -ship and close-quarters combat techniques. Oh, fancy. 
Tours of Duty in the Mongolian Defense Force and Trans System Federation. Disarmedly discharged from the TSF 15 years ago for going off mission. Details classified. Emissary Kassar Kasa reports Meta was hired to accompany Paul Torgal on board the Degasi into uncharted space and defend the ship in case of assault by pirates or rival corporations. Interesting. So, in this universe, like different. Um. Did it? What does? Cool. Kind of. It's a little glitchy. Um. Different, like, corporations fight each other. It's almost like countries or whatever. Or. Yeah. That's interesting. Cool. Well, um. This is by far the longest video I've ever made. Got lots to cut out. So thank you guys for watching. And we'll see you guys next time. Bye.